I'm doing good. How are you? I'm doing great. I'm over here uh, Skyping from uh, Skyping in place at home in Playa del Carmen. Nice, nice. Uh, oh, oh my Thanks. gosh. Okay, so listeners, he is like panning over and I'm seeing like birds of paradise. I'm seeing like these great, like awesome foliage things. Yeah, it's Cinco de Mayo. I'm over here in Mexico. Oh my gosh. Look at you. And so, uh, he's got a mask on and he's got a bucket hat on. So it's almost like grumpier old men about to rob a bank, everybody. That's, that's all I'm going to say. I got my protective eyewear. I'm, I got my PPE just in case what? if I need it. Why do you need PPE? Why? Hey, this makes a good jock strap. Or loincloth, right? Like Bible times, loincloth. Like Tarzan. I got, I got gloves. I'm good. I'm, I'm ready for this podcast. Oh my gosh! Okay, and me, well, I'm like completely non PE. I'm in my own home. I just made the yeah. kids taco meat. I am, I am podcasting with the kids around and cats. You guys having tacos? You guys are having tacos? Yeah, they, they. How are the tacos, kids? Are they good? Yeah. Yeah. I'm having. I'm having a margarita. You're having a margarita? I'm having a Bud Light. There you go. Right, see, there you go. Right on. Okay, they don't say salute. What do they say in Spanish? Yeah, they oh. say salute. I got chips. You got salsa? Oh, my God. Wait, wait. I've got chips. Wait, I've got, I've got a conscious shell. I've got a pastry. And I do have chips. Wait, hold on. Hold on. I'll take the conch shell and I'll raise you a starfish. How about that? I've got awesome chips from Las Solandrinas, and I also have guacamole, and I have salsa, so we are good to go. Oh, you have an umbrella. A wall. Yeah. Okay, this, yeah, I've got, I've got guacamole from Las Solandrinas. It's great. Raiden's helping me with the fridge right now. Oh, what? And this is Raiden's contribution to, uh, oh my gosh, look at your umbrella. Are you still working? I'm working from home. I thought we covered that already. Wait a minute. So you took the truck. As she made this. It's a chocolate pudding with uh, graham cracker crumb crust and cool it. So wait. So, so you took the truck. I took the truck back to work. Why? That's where it belongs. And then I got on the, I got on the first chartered flight to Playa del Carmen. That's my house. I, I take a jet okay. back and forth. Okay, is Dice with you? Huh? Is Dice with you? Uh, no, he, he couldn't make the flight. But we are all what? in this together. We're all in this, except for he, he's not in this today. <laughs> oh, he's going to give you an earful for this, let me tell you. Yeah, well, I'm sure he's having fun. I think he invited his girlfriend over. Oh, my gosh. I, I was listening to your podcast, so... So who is this girl? Like, who's he calling honey to? I'm like, what? He calls someone yeah, he's honey? Yeah, he, he, he's dating this Mexican chick. Well, she better have made him some good food, you know what I mean? She's Not the good some- cook. Yeah. Every awesome. now and then he'll, he'll bring something home. Don't tell me you get a sloppy seconds. That's gross. What's that? Don't tell me you get a sloppy seconds. That's gross. No, 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 no. It's uh, I let Dice have fun with his his girl. I do, I do want to try her tuna salad because she says she makes a mean tuna salad. Um, and so he and I got into a, like a little argument because he thought I was hitting on his girl. I heard about that. Oh my god! I figured he was yeah. gonna, someone was going to come to blows somewhere. Like he yeah, was had, Like he was like yeah. all sets. Like, you know what? now. Now uh, everything is uh, there's a bunch of peace. You know, it's all it's all peace, love, and happiness right now. Oh this is a my God. Cindy Williams. Oh, get that from? She's, she's, she sends her love, peace, and happiness. So um, we just need you to find uh, Laverne. I got Shirley covered. Okay, wait a minute. So podcast listeners, because you're gonna hear this on the audio when I convert it. He just right. showed. Photographed, autographed picture of Cindy Williams from Laverne and Shirley doing, saying love, peace, and happiness, you know. And I'm she's like, wearing a hoodie. She's wearing a hoodie. Yeah, 
and she's doing the peace sign. Where did you get that? Um, I can't reveal my sources. It's uh, okay. confidential. Okay, so the nerd in me. Okay, so listeners, I will reveal this about me. When I As was like nerd, 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 nerd. Nerd, nerd, nerd. I was when I was eight to twelve years old. I would send buckets of letters to celebrities to the stations, the, to the TV stations that they worked at, at the at the TV shows that they worked at, asking for their autographs, and sometimes asking them, "Hey, if you could say this, that'd be great." And I would probably only get maybe ten percent back from what I sent out, which, on the retrospect. My parents endorsing that and just giving me envelopes and letters and stamps, you know, knowing this was a crazy idea, you know, they were okay with it. They never yelled at me about it. I still have my collection to this day. I like the Golden Girls. I've got like Night Court. I've got all these things. So oh, wow. So an autographed picture, I was just like, what? I might even let you have that. Yeah, you froze up. Are you that excited? What do they say on uh, Black Panther? Don't freeze. Wakanda forever. Everybody, I might auction this, um, but I don't know. I do kind of like my uh, co-host, so. I mean, if the price is right, uh, we can go ahead and uh, auction that, but... Um, I could what I could give her actually, um, as long as she shows me her starfish, I might give her a Jumanji DVD. She was looking for a Jumanji DVD, and uh, this is the original. You know, there's no like The Rock and uh, Kevin Hart. They cannot be found. Only Robin Williams on, on Jumanji, the original. Not Welcome to the Jungle. Not whatever else it's called. This is the collector series, even. So, we're over here on Cinco de Mayo. Hope you guys are having a blast. Um, she's a great editor, so I'm sure she'll take whatever footage that uh, she has here. She'll splice it together when she calls me back with the new footage. And uh, in the meantime, I'm going to have some more chips without the salsa because I'm over here. Just getting off work, took a flight. You know, I fly over to uh, Playa del Carmen. I fly back and forth. And uh, every now and then I'll take a bus into Cancun for the weekend. But, um, you know, Cinco de Mayo is a very important holiday. But it's not to be confused with Cinco de Marzo, which is my birthday. And, uh, you know, they're both great holidays. I recommend celebrating them both. Um, and it happens to be Taco Tuesday. So maybe she's maybe those tacos were ready and she's feeding her kids, which that's quite all right. But um, I'm going to go ahead and uh, sign off and then hopefully we'll get back on here and finish this wonderful podcast uh, called Cooch. No, it's Coach. When she does it, it's Coach. When I do it, it's Cooch. Coach, uh, the confessions of a creative has been and Cooch a collection of other creative has-beens. Thank you very much. And we're out of here. Let's see if I can, like... Everybody should pick up some PPE uh, protective eyewear so that they can look like uh, Bono.